This video will go over creating a time clock using the QAdmin software. Please note this is for the Quantum versions 1.5 to 2.7. Now that we have the QAdmin software open, let's see how to create a time clock in the software. Time clocks are created under the Time Clock sub-tab. First, click on the Control and Monitoring tab. Click on Time Clock sub-tab. First, click Set up Time Clock Events. This will unlock the Launch Time Clock Wizard button. Next, click Launch Time Clock Wizard. Click the Next button. Select Add New Time Clock. In the text box, you will define the name of the time clock. Click Next. Click Add Remove Output. The output of a time clock is the item that you want to affect. There are many options for output of a time clock. However, in this example, we will only be affecting lighting areas. Now that lighting areas is selected from the drop-down, use the area tree to select the affected lighting areas. Click OK. And click Next. Now that the time clock is created, you need to add events to the time clock. An event is a series of commands that the system executes at the specified time. Click New Event. Rename the time clock event. Using a reference to the specific action or event in the event name helps keep track of what exactly is happening when in a system. Choose a time. Astronomic will use a floating time that is relative, either at, before, or after, to sunrise or sunset. Fixed time is used when a specific time is required, regardless of sunrise or sunset. Choose weekdays. Select the checkbox for each day that you want the time clock event to take place on. Next, you need to set levels for the defined output. This is done by selecting the drop-down menu for each output. When lighting areas are selected as an output, the default level settings are Area Scenes. The available area scenes were the same scenes defined for each individual area. Click the Save button. Let's add another new event. Click New Event. Let's rename the event to Time Clock Event Night Off. Now we'll set the time to 7 p.m. This event will take place Monday through Friday. Next, we need to set all of the areas to Scene Off. Clicking the Save button will save the event to the time clock. Click Next. By default, the time clock events will be applied to every day of the year. If you want to define events to happen on a special holiday schedule or day, you need to select the second radio button for holidays.
we will be selecting the first radio button in this example. Click Next. Click the Save and Close wizard. Q reporting will need to be restarted. Click OK. Maximize the Lutron Service Manager screen. Under Q reporting, click Stop for Q reporting. Now click Start for Q reporting. Once Q reporting is started, the system is in sync and will operate properly. You have now successfully created a time clock for your quantum system using QAdmin.